So teaching someone in one minute, essentially, that's what you're saying. That's it. Yeah, but vi- visually. Absolutely. Yeah, because that's b- a big difference between, say, explaining it visually as opposed to reading it or having to read it or telling someone about it. 100%. Yeah. It's how many, how many times have you watched reels on Instagram? Oh, yeah. Yeah, they're easy or, to watch. Or TikTok. Yeah. You know, it just never ends. It's like, you know, I mean, people love that consuming information in one minute. Anything more than one minute is too long. Mm. So, so wh- why isn't the entire construction industry focused on one minute learning? Mm. Breaking down complex situations into small bite sized consumable bits of information. Mm. Mate, I think you've hit onto something pretty amazing there. You, know, you reckon? Um, oh, fuck you. Like, that's, um, yeah, I'm just sitting here going, shit, how can I teach some of our team in one minute? You know, what? Yeah. It, to, to be able to break a skill down or break a project down into one minute sections and you know drip feed it to people uh, you've got a way better chance of uh, them understanding it yeah yeah Fuck, man. do you think it, that could be your bloody uh, your real little superpower there right eh? <laughs> you reckon <laughs> yeah like I mean, I'm, I'm totally winging it here <laughs> <laughs> fake it till you make it man that's, that's part of being in business eh? like you've got you to do this shit to yeah. figure out what works and as soon as you figure out what works that's when you, you absolutely hone in on it yeah yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. But, yeah. but it's not impossible I've, I've, I've already animated a few 4D videos mm. now but um, that's on for the whole kind of building site as mm. a whole so now you know I'm, I, I, I started doing something interesting as well I go on all these construction sites, um, and m- some of the hardest things for me was actually is actually going and telling the entire job site you're in delay. Oh yep. I've done it for ten years. <laughs> yeah, I've I've had nightmares about it. I've sat and thought about how do I tell these bunch of people that they are in delay very creatively, without pissing them off. Mm. But how do I then extract positive change out of it? To a point, I got fucking sick of it, man. Mm. <laughs> like, mm. Like, why am I always the bad guy? Yeah. I'm not the bad guy. You be the bad guy all the time. Yeah, yeah. right? So now, now what I do is I take a snapshot of that model of where they should be at the end of every single month. Yeah. Put a date up there. Print it out in um, A3, A0, whatever. Mm. Stick it up in the smoker room. Say, January, February, March, April, May. This is what your site should look like. Wow. Yeah. Oh, that's cool, man. I yeah. like that. And I'll literally walk away from there. Mm. And I come back at the end of every month. Mm. And guess what? They start by telling me, so by the way, you know that steel in that section has not gone up yet. Here's the reasons why. Mm. So we may be in delay. Mm-hmm. <laughs> and I'm like, cool. Yeah. So they already know. There's self-realization now. Yeah, yeah. And it's fucking great. I love it. And they're coming to you, like they're front-footing that. Yeah. Like, it mightn't be good news. It might be bad news. But at least they're coming to you going, look, we've, we we realize we're not where the picture says or whatever. Yeah. But that, that it gets them thinking more. And that, that's actually like real similar to um, you know that visualization stuff, or having you know um, one of those boards that you put your favorite car on, or your favorite house, or your ideal holiday. It's kind of it's like that in a way. It's it's getting people to buy into that message. That's it in a visual way, and and, and getting them all working in that in that same direction. Yeah, eh? but yeah. think about it. He's having a cuppa. Yeah. L- looking around the smoker room. Yeah. What does he see? He sees, oh shit, it's me. Mm. We should be there. Mm-hmm. What a site look like? Yeah, <laughs> okay, nothing like that. Yeah, exactly. You know what I mean? Yeah, that's cool. Yeah, so um, so so I'm I'm trying all these little different different things to improve that communication piece in the construction world, hmm. and um, and it's I, I I think I'm kind of blessed in a way to have the opportunity to work with all of these different companies, and and one understand what they do really well, understand their shortcomings of their systems, processes, technology, whatever it may be, mm. and um, you know um sit and process all of that information, soak it all in. 